fast-tracking U.S. military aid can dramatically expedite an end to the war in Gaza and help prevent a broader war in the Middle East. In World War II, as Britain fought on the front lines of civilization, Winston Churchill appealed to Americans with these famous words, give us the tools and we'll finish the job. Today, as Israel fights on the front line of civilization, I too appeal to America. Give us the tools faster and we'll finish the job faster. When the blood libels against the Jewish state come from people who wear fancy silk robes and speak in lofty tones about law and justice. The day after we defeat Hamas, a new Gaza can emerge. My vision for that day is of a demilitarized and de-radicalized Gaza. Israel does not seek to resettle Gaza, but for the foreseeable future, we must retain overriding security control there to prevent the resurgence of terror, to ensure that Gaza never again poses a threat to Israel. The occupation existed long before him. We all know that by refusing to be stopped. We're here today um, to say that the American people um, reject the presence of this war criminal here and that really the only place that he should be is uh, behind bars. I, I'm a tax-paying U.S. citizen and I can't believe that my taxes are continuing to fund a genocide. Um, I think that's unacceptable. And I can't believe he's here asking for more money when there are people literally dying. <laughs> אנחנו כאן כדי לזעוק שיש עוד חטופים וחטופות חיים וחייבים להחזיר אותם בחיים עוד היום! אין להם זמן! הם סובלים והם נרצחים! <אז> 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 <אז>